dinner, we're making white chicken chili in the Instant Pot. So let me show you what is in our dinner. You're going to need some chicken broth, fat-free half and half, two cans of Great Northern beans, two small or one large can of diced green chilies, lots of seasonings. We have cumin, garlic powder, seasoning salt, red chili pepper flakes, onion powder, chili powder. You're also going to need some frozen corn, chicken breasts, salt, and low fat or fat free cream cheese. So let's get out our instant pot and start tonight's dinner. All right, so to get started with our chili, the first thing that we're going to do is add one and three quarter cup of chicken broth to our instant pot. You can also use better than bouillon. I just wanted to use what I had on hand of the chicken broth. And then we're gonna go ahead and add our large can of diced green chilies. And then we're gonna add about one and three quarter cup of frozen corn. And then we're gonna add two cans of the Great Northern beans. You do wanna drain them, just don't rinse them. Actually, it's one and a half cups of corn, so I apologize. I still have quite a bit left here in my bag. And then we're gonna go ahead and add in our spices. So I went ahead and just measured everything out here in a bowl, and we're gonna go ahead and just add that in. And then lastly, we're gonna put in our pieces of chicken. You make sure that you trim them of any fat. We're gonna give this a quick stir, and then we'll turn it on and get our chili cooking. After we've stirred our Instant Pot, we're gonna go ahead and put our lid on, make sure it's closed, and we're gonna set it manually for 18 minutes. And then we are going to let that naturally release. We're gonna let this naturally release for 10 minutes. So when this dial reads 10, we'll go ahead and flip the little switch here and remove the rest of the steam. I just pulled the lid off of the Instant Pot. This smells so good. So the next step is we're gonna go ahead and just take some forks and shred up the chicken. You can remove it if that's easier for you, but I'm just gonna go ahead and shred it the best that I can just directly here in my Instant Pot. And then we'll be ready to add in the cream cheese and our half and half. Bar, another glass and I am going places makes me laugh. About the irony of everything I like the way you're thinking I don't really care about Once you've shredded your chicken, we're gonna go ahead and add in one half of a cup of fat-free half and half. And then we're also going to add in four ounces of our fat-free or reduced fat cream cheese. I'm just gonna give this a quick stir. We're gonna throw the lid back on the Instant Pot and let this simmer. It is on the natural release still and let it simmer for about five minutes or until the cream cheese melts and we can mix everything together. one on the purple plan and five on the green plan. I did go ahead and top it with two smart points worth of light shredded cheese. And the cheese that I used was the Trader Joe's light shredded three cheese blend. Also a couple of saltine crackers and some parsley. So again, one point on both blue and purple, five on green, and then you would have to add on your cheese and any other toppings that you use. But this is the Instant Pot White Chicken Chili. Thank you for joining me on another WW Instant Pot recipe. I hope you guys are as excited about this as I am. We loved this. I repeat, loved this recipe. My husband even loved it and he gets tired of chicken. Like he complains that we have too much chicken and he loved it. It is a must make, it is family friendly, it freezes great, it's excellent for leftovers. Just highly, highly recommend that you make this recipe. So down in the description box is the recipe that I made all of the ingredients, the amounts, cooking instructions, everything. Again, you can make this on your stove top or in your slow cooker if you do not have an Instant Pot. So there are options, just definitely make this recipe. Also in the description box is the links to my favorite things, as well as anything I can save you a discount on. So check out the description box below. If you're new, welcome. I'm so excited that you came over to my channel. Please take a moment and subscribe. Right next to the subscribe button is a bell. Hit that so you're notified whenever I upload a new video i'd appreciate a big thumbs up if you love instant pot recipes and of course comment down below let me know is this a recipe you're going to make 
highly recommend. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! What's it like to be the one that he turns to when he's